hello in the last video we finished here uh, we saw that uh, this is an equation of an ellipse let me give you an overview so this was the equation uh, we uh, did completing of squares uh, we got here we divided each by 36 to get a one year and uh, then we saw that this is equation of an ellipse because this is very similar to this the only problem between this and this this is centered at zero zero now this is not centered at zero zero so there is one more formula which i will show on a graphic calculator this is the more general form of an ellipse it is x minus h squared over a squared plus y minus k squared over b squared is equal to one so you can compare quite easily this with this okay so what i've done is this i've written in this form to compare this with this so x minus one squared over nine i have written as x minus one squared over three squared to compare with this and y plus two squared i've written as y minus take away two squared over two squared to compare with this so it's very easy to compare you can compare your a with 3 and your b with 2 okay your h is 1 and your k is negative 2 okay now we know the formula of the focus okay or the focal length c is the focal length so focal length is the bigger radius squared minus the or the major radius squared minus minor radius squared so here the major radius is a uh, the major radius is 3 and the minor radius is 2 so c squared is equal to a squared minus b squared now a squared is 9 and b squared is 4 so 9 squared 9 minus 4 is 5 and square root of 5 square root of 5 is 2.2 in 1 dp okay now let us graph it okay now to, this is uh, I've used a maths tool of smart technology or smart board to draw graph this. So we know the center is one negative two. So this is one negative two. This is the center. The major radius is three. So you go three from this side on on the right hand side from the center. So at one two three. So the one point is four negative two, and you go three to the left. So that is negative 2, negative 2. Now the minor radius, so let me draw a radius so that you can see. This, so this is the minor major radius, one major radius, and this is the other major radius. Okay. So this is the minor radius. Uh, I can't draw that. So, so this is the uh, minor radius of 2. So it, in, it passes through 1, 0, and this is the other point. So if you go 2 down, you reach one negative four now the focus is always on the major axis this is also called the major axis and this is called the minor axis okay so the major x so c is 2.2 uh, in 1 dp means you have to go 2.2 to the right and left to get the 2 4 psi so if you go 2.2 to the right you reach 3.2 so this I'll show this on a calculator. This is 3.2, and this negative uh, negative 1.22 something. Okay. So this is these are the two uh, four sides. Okay. Now let us do this on a graphic calculator. So let me uh, recapitulate. So this is your center one negative two. This is the major axis. This is the minor axis. Okay, so this is the major radius of 3, and you've got a minor radius of 3, 2. And uh, your focal length is square root of 5. And the your focus is always on the major axis. So you have to go 2.2 to the right and left of the center on the major axis. So you go 2.2 to the right, you get to the first focus which is F1, and if you go 2.2 to the left from the center, you reach the second. So let us do this and check whether our answer is right. So 
that's always a good thing to do and that's what is exciting about a graphic calculator you can always check your answer so uh, what was the equation so uh, this is not what we want this is ellipse so this is an ellipse okay so if you remember if you remember uh, a a is 3 b is 2 so they're asking you what is a so the a is the major radius so enter 3 uh, minor radius is 2 okay and uh, this is x minus 2 squared if you remember so uh, x minus 1 squared so h is 1 and k is negative 2 okay so k is negative 2 enter and draw okay now i'll show this i'll scroll this up so this is can you see this is the ellipse you can compare this with this and then you go g sol oh you got the focus here okay so let us see what's the vertex okay so these okay so let us look at the focus so this is one point which is three point can you see this this compare this with this that's your first focus which is on the major axis which is 3.23 negative 2 and this is the other focus which is minus 1.23 which is this point compare this with this it's always on the major axis okay now g sol what's the x intercept can you see this is 1 0 this is 1 0 okay again g so you do you can't you do have only one x intercept okay what about y intercept uh, it's very difficult to show this is negative uh this is your y intercept and that's you can see here okay negative 3.8 that's not important it, it's very difficult to plot the vertex okay the center okay the center is one negative two okay one negative two and uh, the vertex Okay, so this is one vertex which is four negative two you can check that and uh, the other uh, other vertex is one uh, negative four okay that is so let, okay it tells us all the vertex i didn't know that so this is this is negative two negative two and uh, okay and the last vertex is one zero so these are all called the vertex thank you very very much and uh, see you in the next video. Thank you.